So Elion, I told you about the press release from the Ghana Medical Association, and I do have it now. This release was signed by the president of the association and its general secretary, and it reads that the Ghana Medical Association, GMA, is taking into consideration the number of new COVID-19 cases in the country, mostly from community spread and seeming disregard for all the preventive measures put in place by large sections of the population, hereby states as follows that the COVID-19 pandemic is real and it is here with us in Ghana and is still a major health threat to all persons living in the country. Non-adherence to the COVID-19 preventive measures at this point in our collective fight against the disease has a huge potential to erode any gains made so far. This has also the propensity of to escalate further spread of the disease. All persons living in Ghana should endeavor to adhere strictly to all the preventive measures such as the ban on public and social gatherings, social distancing, use of face mask, hand washing and the running water with soap and the use of alcohol-based hand sanitizers. Government should strictly enforce all the preventive measures so far put in place to ensure compliance. His Excellency, the President of the Republic, should not lift the ban on social gatherings for religious activities, schools, my ceremonies, funerals, etc. Our international borders should remain closed for now. Government must ensure prompt and continuous distribution of PPE to all health workers at their various institutions or places of work at all times. This will guarantee the safety of all health workers as they continue to render care to patients. And the last one being all medical doctors and other health professionals should continue to dedicate themselves to the fight in the interest of Mother Ghana in spite of the huge sacrifices we have made so far. And that's from the Ghana Medical Association. We'll bring you more of that in our subsequent bulletin.